Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to show you two journal spreads and the products that I'm using throughout these journal spreads um, mainly are from the Kiki K Paper Lovers book. If you want to go see a flip through of this book, I did a flip through in my last video and had a little bit of chat about the sad news hearing that Kiki K is going into voluntary administration. So if you want to hear that chat, go check out my latest video. And in these journal spreads, I'm showing, um, basically I'm collaging photos from the Mardi Gras parade that I went to with a bunch of my work colleagues and also Dan and I's seven year anniversary. <laughs> We've been together for seven years now. It's crazy. It doesn't even feel like that long. And we went out for brunch that day, so I took a few photos and I printed on the, them on the sprocket. So I just wanted to create a little collage of memories. And for the Mardi Gras parade, it was so much fun. As I said, I went out with a few work colleagues and they all came to mind. I made a little um, cheese platter beforehand and dressed the house up. Um, and basically we got dressed at mine and getting dressed actually was one of the funnest parts I think of the night because we found costumes and we did our makeup and it was like all glittery <laughs> and we just had a few drinks beforehand. But the parade was so much fun. We stood for about three hours, so a very long time. Um, but yeah, it was quite a fun night. I got some good photos. So I printed them out and wanted to make a little journal spread. So I also just wanted to give you guys an update of what's been happening in my life recently. So um, big announcement, I got a TikTok finally, a TikTok account. Um, so I create a little profile. I've got videos of basically a lot of um, melting wax and creating little wax seals um, like stamps and I've been finding it really fun it's quite a creative community there and they're 15 to 60 second videos so I've had a lot of fun trying to create such short videos and I'm gonna really work on that profile so go follow me on TikTok if you want to go check out my videos if you haven't got an account already I would highly recommend it it's very addictive because um, you can just sit there and watch so many videos one after the other and I've been having a lot of fun with it um, if you don't already know I think I mentioned it in a previous video but Dan and I are also moving to Brisbane, which I'm really excited about. It's officially being confirmed. I've let my manager know at work and um, yeah, we're going to be heading up there. I'm going to find a new job. We're going to find a new place. It's going to be a um, really exciting time. We're moving up. Um, I think it's around three months away now. So I'm going to go on a road trip with one of the girls from work and show her all along the East Coast. And I'll film it for you guys if you want to see a vlog. So let me know if you do want me to create a moving vlog. I've downloaded some really cool apps on my phone to create videos. So I might try to create some vlogs on my iPhone. And yeah, let me know if you want me to create a few um, and what kinds of videos you want me to create while moving. Um, but other than that, I also just wanted to have a chat with you about the whole coronavirus situation. As a lot of you guys know, we are in toilet paper drought here in Australia. Literally, the stores, um, the supermarkets have just been restocking and then they're just selling out in ridiculous amounts of time. So. Uh, we've actually, because as you, a lot of you guys already know, I work in recruitment, so I'm in quite a large recruitment agency here in Australia, and we've just had, we've just placed 700 temporary staff members out working for um, supermarkets across Australia, and basically they're just helping out restocking all the shelves. We've been low on meats, pastas, toilet paper. It's just ridiculous. People are going into panic mode and just re like they're just stocking their homes up. So um, we've got lots and lots of temp workers out helping restock all the shelves. But yeah, it's been like one of our temp workers called me up today and said toilet paper was sold out in 10 minutes. It is crazy. We've just been hearing ridiculous stories across the news as well. So that's what's been happening in Australia. Sydney specifically, because as I said, I'm in recruitment, so I've been talking to a lot of businesses and a lot of our clients have been saying that majority of their staff are 
either working from home currently or they're sending them home um, start of next week. So a lot of people will now be isolated at home and um, yeah, anyone who's traveled overseas, they have to be quarantined, um, sorry, isolated for 14 days and we're just not allowing anyone to work if they've either been sick or overseas or been in contact with someone who's been overseas. So crazy times. I'd love to know what's been happening in your country or your towns. Um, so do let me know in the comments below what you've been up to throughout this time, what's been happening um, and what, what, yeah, basically if you've been on lockdown, if you're getting sent home. Um, our company said that we're most likely gonna get sent home next week as well. They started running tests out to make sure that they've got um, the, enough um, tech basically like storage and things like that to um, send everyone home to work from home. Other than that, um, yeah, everyone's just been selling out of face masks, hand sanitizer, and as I said, the standard things in the supermarkets, toilet paper, pasta and, and meat. So those are the things that we've been running out a lot of. Uh, but don't worry, I've stocked up. <laughs> um, I've got enough to last me for the next two weeks, hopefully. And I've, I know a few convenience stores that I can go to if I'm running low on those products as well. So yeah, I just thought I'd give you guys an update, especially around the whole coronavirus, COVID-19. Um, and yeah, show you a bit of my journal spread. So I hoped you enjoyed a bit of a chat today and my journal spreads. And yeah, I'll keep updating you guys on what's been happening in my life, but always love to know what's been happening in your lives let me know in the comments below go follow me on tiktok um and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye